Hi, I'm Jake, and welcome to another Machinery Hacks. When you're in the market for a new thicknesser or jointer, there are three cutter heads available to you. Let's go through them. So the first one we're gonna talk about today is a straight blade cutter. It is the bread and butter of the thicknesser and jointer world. Uh, they are the entry level cutter block for almost every thicknesser and jointer on the market. Uh, they feature anywhere from two, I believe, up until maybe four or five knives uh, that span the entire length of the cutter block. Now, the advantages of these are that they're very economical, uh, they are easy to change the blades over if they are damaged, and they're very affordable to do so. Although they are more economical and much more affordable, they are louder, and you will end up spending a lot more time cleaning up after them. So the next one we're going to go on to is the segmented spiral head, so the one that I've got in the middle here. So the segmented spiral head is more of a combination between the straight blade and the helical head in that the spiral refers to the manner in which the knives remove the material and the segment refers to the sections of the knives placed on the cutter block. The advantage of these is that the knives themselves are easily replaceable if again you do hit a nail or a stone you can just pop them off and swap them over. The disadvantages of them are that, again, they are quite noisy and they do tend to leave lots of machine marks that you need to clean up afterwards as well. Now, the th of the three, easily the most revolutionary uh, and effective cutter block is your helical spiral head. Helical obviously refers to the manner in which the cutter block twists in a helix. One of the main advantages of these cutter heads is that the knives themselves are very replaceable and they all have four cutting edges on each knife. Now, if you were to hit, say, a piece of sap or a stone um, or a nail and you were to damage one of these knives, it should just be the case of loosening that single knife off, turning it around and then setting it again and you're off and running. Whereas with a straight blade cutter, you have to replace the whole knife. The other advantage of these is the manner in which the cutting motion occurs. So instead of crashing down into the timber, it comes in from the side in more of a shearing motion, which mitigates not all, but almost all of your tear out issues. And because it comes in in more of a shearing motion, there is a noticeable reduction in noise as well. Now, it does cost a little bit more up front. It's of the three cutter heads, it's definitely the least affordable, but the advantage of this cutter head apart from all the tear out that you'll reduce is the amount of time that you'll save. So that time translates into less sanding, it translates into less cleanup, and it translates into you being able to finish your project quicker and save yourself some time. And that's it, I'm Jake, and we'll return you now to your regularly scheduled program. Mm -hmm.